Boys, I'm so excited. A new Acheron video just came out, and I'm really hoping that it answers some questions about her lore. I really want to know about the girl with the horns. If that's Raiden May, if that's Acheron, like, what's going on? I need to know. I'm really excited. Another Acheron video is out, and I really, really hope it gets more into her lore. And we get to find out a bit about her. Maybe even Kiana. Oh my god, if they... if they mentioned Kiana, I'm going to lose my mind. I, I need her in this game. Please. I, I'm so excited. I really need to see this. Let's get into it, boys. Do you still remember why Izumo forged these blades? Who's talking? Because in times past, when the Yao Yorozu no Kami descended here, they wrought death and disaster on this world and its people. Oh, there to save she the is, world, boys! He's right in Bay! 70,033 blades and forged them into the 12 Sentinels. <gasps> is that where Kiana May met? Truth, forged Bro, the that's the, the, the city where Kiana May met? It may it first teach you the Hershey Thunder the law and create miracles oh, from the deconstruction of all things. Chat, my theory the second was Scott, is that she's like a, a Kiana-less May. It could form a barrier from the firm. And when she became the Hershey Thunder the gods of misery from in that city, she just destroyed everything. Because Kiana the wasn't there to spite her and stop her. Able to summon lightning to rend the heavens and meteors to rain down divine punishment. The fourth was missed. Able to break earth and tear cloud with Is that a reference to Genshin's ride in A? Killing the, the snake? Howl, able to summon lightning to rend the heavens and meteors to rain down divine punishment. The fourth was missed. Able to break earth and tear cloud with biting wind and I think it was. The fifth was frost. Freezing the land in an instant. The sixth was fate, the restless cycle of life and death. Then there was flare, thought, root, form, bind. Oh, this is giving me like Naraka vibes. With those sentinels, <laughs> we seized on tomorrow's expectation, winning victory after victory until all of them were broken. That's like kind of corny. I ain't gonna lie. The world in its entirety. And in the end, that See, entirety, okay. entirety. So, for anyone that hasn't played Honkai Impact, May became the Hersher Thunder in a city that looks a lot like this. She went to school here. She be like accidentally became the Hersher Thunder and went like berserk and started like destroying the city. And Kiana came and fought her, and then stopped May from dying in this city and then they later on in the story when she became the Hershey thunder a second time they fought again in the city and this looks an awful lot like the city that they first met in and then the one they fought in later which is why i have a big theory that either the second time they fought she killed kiana in the city or that she never met kiana in the first place and destroyed the city the first time around because the first time around, Kiana fought her and got her out of the Hersher Thunder mode. So that's kind of my theory going on with this right now. But I don't know. I really hope they answer it. I, Dude, I need Kiana in this game. Please. And in the end, that entirety was lost. And so Izumo splintered 12 sentinels and forged them into two bearers. The first was origin. The second was end. The world forged 70,047 blades, and only one could save Izumo. But you and I both know the road to salvation does not exist. I still don't get if this There's is no Akron. I'm confused. Resisting the Kamigami, humanity will eventually become If it's only. two personalities, we pull the Honkai Impact. This is the Hurst for Thunder personality, too. In times past, 
Takamagahara, upon which the Kami descended, was surely as beautiful as Izumo. So, do you still remember why Izumo forged these blades? Because of a lie. An end that never existed. We long since strode into their shadow. Each step forward one that we can never walk back. Until the last blade is forged into... Not. But she loses her life. Bro, this just makes me... I have more questions! Stop it! This, it just, this just makes me question more than... And yet, bro, and yet. I, fuck. I thought they would answer more. Now I just have more questions. Like, why does the horns go away? Like, is it two personalities? I don't get it. I was really hoping that we get some mention of Kiana. I don't know. The city, I feel like, is the closest thing to kind of give us a hint. Because this... This city looks a lot like the one that they fought in. And also, when she became the Hersher Thunder, people around her became like Honkai zombies, basically, which we saw that. Where was it? Here. See, these guys look like kind of like the humans that became zombies. The world forged 70 these guys down here. But, oh, man, dude. I <laughs> This character needs to come out. I'm so excited. I'm so excited for her. Thank you. I need answers, man. I really need answers. I feel like we're not going to get it. We're probably not going to get the answers for a while of what's going on with her. I feel like she's going to kind of be like the Dane's leaf of this game, if that makes sense. I hate comparing her to a Genshin character. <laughs> <laughs> but I feel like she's gonna be like the Dainsley for this game almost. Where she kind of shows up at important lore moments. You kind of know like shit's gonna go down whenever she's around. I feel like she'll continue to pop up. It won't just be like Penaconi will be it. I feel like we're definitely gonna see her on other planets. She'll probably likely be there at the end of the story because she's this game's May if I had to take a guess. But this here really makes me think that this is supposed to be like a bad ending May, basically. One that wiped out the city and didn't have Kiana to stop her. But I guess we'll just have to... That's a wait a minute! Oh, I don't want to! Anyways, YouTube... I, I think I've done enough rambling about my, my Honkai Impact X Honkai Star Rail theories. I hope you guys have a good night. Uh, I'm gonna stream tomorrow. Uh, what's today? Um, March 22nd around 9, 10 p.m. So if you want to catch me live, I'll probably watch this again live with my chat. Hope you guys have a good day. Don't forget to subscribe. And I'll see you guys hopefully in 2.1 for uh, Acheron polls. Bye-bye, YouTube! Bye!